What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to a fine edition of the Man Cave Reaction Videos. Today, we're going to be listening to Little Great Weight. And the song is one of them songs you... God, you don't hear this shit on the radio, man. They, I don't even think they ever did play it. Rotten rap bastards. <laughs> Anyways... This song's called Lady Red Light. You don't hear this stuff on the radio, man. The only way you're going to hear... You ain't even going to hear this shit on the other freaking somebody else's reaction video. Because I'm the one out here putting this stuff that you don't hear every day. And you remember, you listen to. We had to go out and buy the freaking cassettes because the rap bastards wouldn't put it out on the radio. No. We had to listen to that shit ourselves. We had to discover it ourselves. We didn't have YouTube. We didn't have streaming shit. We didn't have... Hell, back when I first got started, just just got MTV. And then they were playing Video Kills and Radio Star and... Yeah. Anyways. I love the way this song starts out, man. He just starts out that freaking guitar, that just that riff. That... Da -da 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 -da. <sighs> So freaking badass, man. Get it, man. These 80s guitar players, man. And this... I love the sound of his guitar riffs on this song, man. It's just like Sexy. That bass, sexy. What's he talking about? What was all the eighty band talking about? Go with that ice cream cone. I mean, you know, I mean. Get that little bend in there. Any idea what he's talking about? Like every one of these 80s bands did, everything was sex. Sex, drugs, rock and roll. I freaking love that little bend. These, these 80s bands had a way of incorporating so many instruments in their songs. Just so freaking talented, man. It's unbelievable. I mean, they do horns, they do strings, they do freaking keys, harmonicas, you name it, man. They did it. Freaking amazing. Freaking amazing. All had that guitar player, man. The badass freaking metal ripping, freaking shredding. 60s 
谢。I've seen these guys, man, two or three or four times. They're fantastic. Fantastic. I feel bad for you guys that didn't get to grow up in the 80s, man. Man, you guys missed it. We had stacks of freaking concert tickets, man, waiting for concerts to go to. I mean, it was, seriously, I mean, it was like stacks. Tickets were like 18 bucks a piece back then. Front row. You go to two or three concerts a freaking week. It was insane, man. Insane. Of course, back then when you got tickets, you had to go stand in line at freaking Kaufman's or your freaking store. You had to stand in your store or whatever. Hold on, God damn it. Okay. Yeah, you had like, in order to get your tickets back then, you had to go stand in line. There wasn't no calling that shit in or whatever. You had to just go and stand and wait. We'd always go up a day and a half before and stand in line at the mall. And we'd always be like the second or third people in the door. You know, we always got our front row tickets. Every freaking concert, we was front row because we, that's just what we did. Now it's like bullshit, you know, waiting on the freaking phone or whatever, trying to call that shit in, trying to get tickets, and they're freaking all gone in five minutes because of freaking scamming. Mm, okay, anyways. All right, we're going to let this go. All right. If you like what you're seeing, give me a thumbs up, ring my bell, and hit that subscribe button. And you're going to see more crazy ass videos on the main cave. Until next time, peace out.